Hi, my sweeties. Okay. Marilyn G. and I have been trying to figure out the chimney part of Tim Holtz's die right here. And it didn't work for her either. So we had an appointment in Nashville today and the whole way home I'm thinking, okay, 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 I paid for this die, I wanna use it. I watched Tim Holtz's video and this is what he did, okay? You've got, this is the roof, right? This is the little square that the chimney is supposed to fit in. This is the top for the chimney. This is the chimney. So I just roughly uh, fold it, cut it, and fold it so it's not, you know, it's not pretty. But here it is. So you see this. Tim Holtz shows. He just pulls it out from that he glued it in here. Let me show you. It's difficult to show. He glued it in here, and he, uh, that's it. Okay. The square he gave us in that die, it falls right through. There is too much space between the chimney and the hole. You cannot put enough glue. You're supposed to put the glue around here and then adjust the chimney in there and boom, you're done. No, this hole, which I used the small hole, you see, this is the small one that goes in the roof. This is the chimney topper. Okay, I don't even think I cut out the chimney topper because I don't care about that. So I've been thinking. So here's what I did. And I think it's gonna work. My hands are shaky. I haven't eaten all day and it's 3.30. We just got back from Nashville. Uh, VA appointment for my gene. But anyway, so here's what I did. I cut the roof, right? I cut the hole in. I cut with a 110 pound car cart stock the chimney and then regular cart stock. I didn't line it up right. I don't care about that right now. It's, it looks ugly, but of course, if I was going to do it, then I'll do it right. Okay, and now it fits like Tim Holtz showed, except he didn't say that he just cut it out. Okay, now it fits. And of course, what you would have to do is you raise the front part. You, you, you glue it like diagonally, because the front, oh, it's so hard for me to show, let me see. The front of the chimney has to be higher. <laughs> All you see is my fat fingers. You know what I mean. Let's see if I can do it this way. Yeah, look, it's not even yet. But the front of the chimney, this front, has to be, of course, higher than the back. So it looks like, uh, see, I cut the hole crooked in the roof because I just wanted to try to think. So now, Marilyn G. and everybody else that has trouble... You know, Tim Holtz, you charge a lot for your dice. I expect better. <laughs> Am I gonna get in trouble now? Nah. Okay, now I'm putting on the glue, you see. All right, let's shove it in the hole. And we have to shove it in. Cause see, he, he had it in where he actually had trouble getting it out to show cause it was glued in, of course. Okay, what did I say? Oh, the back of the roof has to be lower than the front of the roof, or it looks like a deformed chimney. But you see? Okay, get rid of the glue. And it works. But I'm, it's great. I'm going to make more houses. You see, it's perfect now. It's perfect. You see? You can't see, right? Because it's the stupid ankle of my camera, but I can't help it. But it's right, it's right. And of course, you'll clean up the glue. I just did it to, to show you. Uh, Marilyn, I figured it out. I figured it out. But according to him, you don't have to do it this way. You just cut the hole, 
You just cut your chimney, glue it, shove it in like I just did, except you have to use 110 card, 110 pound card stock, and then regular card stock or paper, you know, the 65 pound, whatever it is. And then it fits. Ta-da! It's a lot of work for one chimney, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I did make something, I was gonna show it for Saturday, but I'm gonna show it now, because the, the, the chimneys aren't, uh, yeah, see, now you can put on the little chimney top if you want. But see, I'm not even worried about the chimney top because I'm thinking, uh, what if I put a little cotton on there? Look, it's so small, I can't, my hand's shaking, I've got to eat. Okay. See, you can glue it on here and make it look like that. Of course, I just use scrap paper. You'll make it prettier. See? But anyway, um, I made this, and it's without the chimneys because I didn't figure it out yet. So I made this over the weekend because I have a lot of, between Sheena and I, we have a lot of doctors and surgeons, and I thought I'll make them off and put it on their desks because before Christmas, we'll see them plenty of more times. Even my dentist, I gotta go get my teeth cleaned. Rather have a baby if I didn't have to race it. But anyway, <clears throat> so I made this over the weekend, but I didn't show it uh, the complete thing. I showed the houses, I think, but I didn't show the complete thing because I wanted the chimneys. Now it's too late to put the chimney in because you gotta cut the hole in the chimney, of course, at the same time or whatever you wanna do. But see, now it's right. I just have to, like, to push the back. I wish you could see it better. But wait, 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 wait. Maybe, 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 maybe I can show you on the house that I already made. See, look, it would be. No, it still doesn't show up good, does it? Do you know what else you have to do? Look. This is sticking out now, unless you want it taller. So you're gonna have to trim that, I think. No, you don't, because it goes inside the house. Okay, it looks like I have to trim it because it won't fit on here, because I already got a roof. But see, imagine, well, no. Yeah, sorta kinda, right? You can see it sorta kinda. Anyway, I'm gonna let it go now. I'm gonna let it go, I figured it out. I'm not gonna worry about it no more. I can make more houses with chimneys. And now I'm gonna let you go because I'm working on, well, actually I'm already done with my Saturday makes because I figured we were going to have more appointments and I was right. VA hospital called Jean, we had to go and everything. So I already got my Saturday morning makes made and it's some, um, I um, give you a clue. It's something that Chill Norwood made and I copied it, as usual. Okay, have a great rest of the week. I'll see you on Saturday. Stay safe. Love and be kind to each other. And love and peace.